You've got a strong constitution. Anyone else would have certainly died. What... What happened? Let me tell you a little story. Once upon a time, there was a young boy. He was lost and miserable. He had no future. He was tempted by his friends into doing some foolish things. But he wasn't truly bad, because when it came down to it, he ran away rather than keep doing foolish deeds. His former friends didn't take kindly to that, though, and wanted to punish him. So they sent a hunting dog to find him and rip his throat. The boy wasn't stupid, though, and he knew that the hound was coming. He poisoned some food, and when the hound showed up, he gave it to him. He didn't expect the beast to live, but it did. And all of a sudden the boy was sorry for what he tried to do. So he offered to make a bargain with the hound. I think I understand you. But the beast would need to know what deal he's being offered. You know, we're both pawns in someone else's game. They have plans for us. But we don't have to let them use us. We can just forget all about it and go our own way. I, I was a bandit and I was at Nyhoff. I've robbed and stolen. But I swear to God I've never in my life slain innocent people. What I saw at Nyhoff made me realize my life was worth shit. But I still had a chance to change for the better. Here in the monastery, I've had plenty of time to think things over. But then you showed up and fucked it all up. So the evildoer changes his ways and finds God. And what exactly are you proposing? Both of us can leave this place. You can go back to your people. And I can go somewhere where I can live out my life in peace. And no one will try to kill me. If we work together, we can both get what we want. 